Gina Carano from The Mandalorian is fired. Guys, I want your opinion on this one because I have some real serious views and a real voice that I want to give about this situation. And I want you guys to tell me, do you agree with me or change my mind? Because I think this cancel culture is absolutely out of control. I think that what she said is appalling. But does it mean we have to take away her entire life's work? Delete her from history? Don't give her a chance to grow as a human being? Pedro Pascal, the guy who was the star of The Mandalorian, tried to talk with her and help educate her. She started to come around. She started to say, hey, I'm sorry. I thought was, I was making jokes and I didn't realize that people take certain things seriously and blah, 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 and the hardships that they've gone through. So she's starting to learn. Boom! Lucasfilms Disney fires her. What the hell? Listen, guys, we should be going after the real villains, the racists, the terrorists, the people who have a platform that don't deserve one. It doesn't mean we have to silence an actress because she said stuff that's different than us. Obviously, she needs a little help to become a little bit better informed and better educated about the world and people and differences she doesn't seem to understand. It doesn't mean that we should not give her a chance to grow as a human being. It doesn't mean that we should take away her job as an actress and smear her name like a witch hunt and destroy her life. It doesn't mean that. She's also not inciting violence. It just makes her seem a little bit, you know, lacking in knowledge, okay? But why don't you guys who come together and go after her and are trying to tear her down, I'm talking to you guys, go after the head of the KKK, why should he have a platform? He's inciting violence. Go after anti-Semitic groups who are trying to rip people down. Go after groups who are trying to destroy innocent people just because they're different. Go after groups who are going after innocent people just because they're different than them. Go after the hate groups. Go after the, the, the real conglomerate groups of hatred who are spewing real violence and inciting violence. Go after them. Not some actress from Star Wars Mandalorian who says stupid stuff. She says stupid stuff so we could either A, ignore her, or B, try to actually teach, educate. It's all about communication. Guys, change my mind. Do you disagree with me or do you agree with me? I mean, look, I create comic book superheroes here at Beyond Comics, and it's one of the biggest things that I have always adored about superheroes and comic books. They save people. They promote doing better, growing, growth, the hero's journey. That's a very important thing. So a lot of people start out one way and we hope that they grow to become better, but let's give people a chance. You know what I'm saying? This is an actress. She's not inciting violence. It just makes her seem a little bit, like I said before, lacking and kind of, you know, a little ignorant in certain ways. Uh, again, they did the same thing with that guy from The Flash who played Elongated Man. You know, sure I'm pissed off at the stupid comments he made, but I don't want to destroy his life. I don't want to take away his career. How is it that the people, the bullies and the witch hunters to try to destroy and tear down? Anyway, guys, post your comments below. I want to hear what you have to say, okay? Do you agree, disagree? In my opinion, I think it's about communicating and giving people a chance at redemption. That's what I think. Instead of being this witch hunt where we're silencing people in this cancel culture, this cancel culture, what's going on? Come on now. Now suddenly they're becoming the bullies. Come on, guys. If you're thinking good, don't bully people for having a difference of thought because they're not as knowledgeable as you. Instead, let's try to educate them and help them to see the light. That's all. Let's stop trying to destroy and smear people's names and bully them. It's wrong. Enough bullying, enough smear campaigns. Who's going into people's tweets, by the way, and trying to destroy people like Kevin Hart and that guy from The Flash Show? They're literally scrolling through all their old tweets from like a decade ago, trying to find dirt on them. Who, who is doing this? You know what I'm saying? What is their goal? Do they have nothing better to do? How about you stop going after, you know, these, these co-star actors who are like have little parts on the side and go after the real hate groups? Let's stop the hate group people. They're the ones who can incite violence. They're the ones whose accounts, you know, should be deleted. They should not have a platform to create violence and spread their nasty violence. Those are unhelpable people in those hate groups. They're really, they're really dangerous. So let's stop them. Not some actor and actress who just said some stupid stuff, you know, who, who just are naive and ignorant and need to be helped. 
Okay, guys? Again, post your comments below. This has been comic book artist, writer, and director Greg Wyke from BeyondComics.tv. Make sure to follow and subscribe. And as they say in comics, to be continued. Stay safe out there, guys.